Good evening, America. We just had the new Madden superlatives drop, and I found a great coin making strategy to use. All you gotta do is find the collectibles, and I'm gonna show you exactly how this works step by step. First, we're gonna go to auctions and trades. We're gonna go to that auction house. We're gonna filter it by the correct program and and correct type of card. So the program's gonna be the brand new program. Here we go, we're going to the quality, we're gonna go to elite, and next, the type, we're just gonna do strictly collectibles. So right here, we're gonna show the buy it now price, just to see what the, this, these go for, right? There's a bunch of these categories. You can see the cheapest one is 11K, and that's in the auction house, searching with this one filter. So I'm gonna go to my binder, and I'm gonna click on a few I've already bought in. If you L1 the specific one you bought, you can see that the buy now price goes for seven, six, and that's where we're gonna start making the profit. I brought a few different ones. I filtered through by clicking L1, and this is on PS4, Xbox One's probably the same thing, and you're gonna get this pretty nice filter that's gonna give you these for under, I'm saying seven, five is what I wanna pay for them. Some people might wanna pay less. So, your job with these, is to snipe them for under 7.5, sell them for about 11.5 and you make about 3K about each time you buy. These things are going up. People are mispricing them like crazy right now. This is very similar to when the new content for the Christmas promo drops and the Christmas collectibles, the elites. People bought those for I think three or 4K and then sold them for seven. This is the same deal, man. You got this secret special filter. I'm just filtering through three things going through them and boom, looking for the buy now price, 7K. I'm surprised it didn't cop that. I was probably looking for something under 6.5. But simply put, that's all we're doing. You have the cards and look, look at that. That's even 4K. So we found one for 4K and the next one for 5.4 got eaten up real quick. So if I buy that one for 4K, sell it for 11.5, boom, that's 5K just like that. Since this just dropped today, I'm not sure if they're gonna change it or get rid of this, but if you're able to do it in the next few days, definitely give it a shot. The one con is you do have to get two initial of these elite collectibles, but you can get them from doing the solo, which is like 10 minutes left in the fourth quarter. You're down by 11. I got free two collectibles and I realized, wow, I could sell these for about 10,000 each, but I want to see if the filter was there where you could see them for cheaper. And as you can see, once again, all I'm doing is filtering through the three. Next, there is a set you can do for this, which is you find it in Redemption. Here, there's only one set. You get an elite player, but you add 10 collectibles. So if you want to do the math out, if you snipe for under 7K, that would cost you about 70K to get one of these players. You're gambling there, so I don't like to gamble. I'm not going to do that. I like to gamble on things that make me guaranteed income. And this is a very simple way. As you can see here, I'm pricing these all for about 11.5. And I bought all of them for under seven seventy five hundred. You will get a couple really good snipes that are under. You saw one I had for four, one for five. You get some for six. So with that pricing, you're gonna get like a forty percent return on your investment. And that these, this is really quick, man. I did this in about ten minutes, and I got about I would say ten cards. So once those cards sell, boom, that could be thirty forty k that quick. Just finding something that works at the moment and using it. So this is a definite must use. And you can even do this if you don't have many coins right now. Do, the, do that solo and you get the two of these to start off with. It doesn't matter what one it is. You gotta just run one through each filter. I was surprised that there's not more sets to complete, but I think team of the year is coming out soon. And I think the market's gonna crash hard. There's so much speculation on when it's gonna come out because last year it came out at a different time. And everyone's trying to sell their team like crazy. I got coins in the bank I'm trying to buy. But this will be a good start. They also think that the team of the year collectibles are gonna be back in packs. So we're actually stocking up on a lot of the team of the week hero players and just waiting for that collectible to drop. So we can get players like that. Patty Pete, Calvin Johnson, team of the week. That Sammy Watkins. There was a lot of good players that we can get. Um, so we're banking on that as, as the next market crash from what? But right now, this is the hottest thing I found. Definitely give it a shot. It really can't fail because as you can see, 
when the video started, these things were popping off and selling for 11.5, and you get about 10.3, 10,300 or so on your return. So that's a bare minimum of 3,000 for each one you flip. If you get them for cheaper, you can get 4,000 or even 5,000 if you're really picky and you just keep running this filter. So these keep popping up, man. I mean, 5K, boom, that's an easy four or 5,000 on one flip. I like these snipes instead of bigger snipes because you can do this for an hour and get a lot of money and really build your bankroll and build your team off something like this. So I found this very helpful. Give it a shot before they maybe patch it or get rid of it because it's gonna help you make a lot of coins really quickly. A lot of people struggle to make coins, but these really small coins of three, four K each time add up really quick. That's how you have a nice bankroll of coins. So this just about wraps up the video. Simply put, I hope this was helpful. Hope you can get some coins this way. And this method should work on Xbox One. Remember, keep in mind, this is PS4. But anyways, thank you for watching. Either show us the love with a like, show us the hate, leave a comment if this worked for you, if you have any different strategies to find that work very well. And once again, I hope you enjoyed this. Thank you for watching.